Good morning, it's Rosalie with Can't Wait to Plan. Hope you guys are doing great. And um, so this is part two of my uh, Joanne.com haul. This one I'm focusing on a new collection, or not new, but a collection that's really new to me. It's not even a collection, the entire manufacturer called Do The Bug Design. I've never owned anything from them. Um, as I mentioned in a previous video, I am just starting scrapbooking again after a 14 years hiatus when my kids were young and I. I simply didn't have the bandwidth to do any um, so a lot of um, I'm in search of some new stuff although I still have tons of the other scrapbooking supplies that I um, have from the past they're they're a bit dated and so forth so I thought I would try out some new collection and I've heard a great deal of enthusiasm about doodle bug design so um, when Joanne uh, Joanne sent me a $30 um, on top of any clearance or sale price items that I buy online. I jump at the occasion to do that. So these are called, um, th this is their die cuts. Doodlebug comes up with these things. They're either called chit chat or odd and ends. And they just focus on this particular topic, which is Christmas magic. Now their die cut is not super thick. It's, it's you know, it's um, cardstock, but it's thin, you can see. Um, but it's still very usable, and I love the color. I like the fact that this particular Christmas collection, it does not have the traditional just red and green. It has pink and and um, teal and, you know, aqua or whatever, and gold and yellow and so forth. So I thought this is super cute. Um, I'll, I'll pull it up a little bit closer so you can see all the sentiment in um, close up but I laid all out so you can see now all these collection comes with about 95 to 100 die cut which I think is a great idea their list price on Joanne is nine dollars or eight ninety nine they were on sale for six ninety nine and I got them with my 30 percent discount for four dollars and eighty nine cents so I thought that was a good deal okay um this that was the first uh, board for that one and now these are the bubbles, the conversational bubble. That's why they're called um, chit chat. And so you got all those cute, naughty, I've been good, so much fun, Santa Claus is coming to town, and so forth. And then some cute banners and some nice, um, you know, what do you call these? Almost like a title page thing. But I thought that's so, so cute. So that was Christmas magic. And then the next set I got, I got four sets of these. Um, the next set I got is one that's called Odds and Ends and it's called Cream and Sugar. And you can see it's focusing on cream and sugar. <laughs> so you have the first set come with, I mean, the this set comes with all everything, coffee and tea. You can see I love, I love the faces of, that uh, doodle bug used. They're so sweet and so happy. Easy for us to recreate too if we want to make something to match it. But look at that little cute tea bag and the tea cup and everything else. Even the cute little viewfinder here. Isn't that so pretty? And some hearts and so on. And then the other half of the collection is focusing on sweet treats. Look at how cute the donuts are, the little baking utensil. These are actually Polaroid frames. So you pop these out and the hearts come out. The, the die cut comes right out. And look how cute these little cake stands are. And the Hershey Kisses and the macaroon. And some banners. I love hot cocoa. And look how cute this cake cart is and the bakery. Right? Is that so make you smile, doesn't it? So that was cream and sugar. And then the third set I got is one of the, my God, I can't stand. This is my favorite set. It's called Puppy Love. And that is so true because I love my dogs. I have Sushi and Tootsie are um, a couple of brothers rescue that I we got um, that are Maltese and Yorkie mix. And um, um, they're, we love them to bits. And they're about 12 and a half now. But in any case... Um, so that's that. And then here I show you it on the board so it's a little bit clearer to see. But look at these faces. And I like that they have all the dogs in different colors. So in case you, you know, to, to work best with your collection, here's those Polaroid page again. 
And look at that doggy. I mean, this guy is like so cute. And they have two versions, the, the larger and the smaller. They're slightly different, but they are so cute. Karen, my friend Karen with Yes Please Paper Craft. You need to get this set, girlfriend. I know you don't like your local Joanne store, but you can just get it online because they don't even stock it in the store here. Yeah, she has a really, not a very friendly Joanne in her area where she lives. So anyway, um, and this is the second half of the set. Look how cute those paws are. Most things you get one piece each, but a couple of things like the paws, you get two each. A couple of the hearts you get two each. And then again, the the larger and smaller version of the dogs. Look at this cute dog over here. <laughs> should be he, he should be not that happy for being in the doghouse, but he is so happy. So cute. When well, this guy is like, what the hell is going on? Why are you so happy? Right? So cute. I can't wait to use that. And then the last kit I got is called, um, it's Chit Chat again. So a lot of conversational bubble and it's called Hello. And the colors here is really pretty too. So this one ha has gold foil on it and it has, um, you know, just banners and um, words, sentiment words or lines. You make me happy. Hello, friend. Thank you so much. Um, and so on. It's just very, very pretty collection yeah and then the last one has all the bubbles the conversational bubble um all in those beautiful colors there's so many colors to choose from so you could do whatever you like and work with a lot of different different collections um i don't i didn't see the collection that goes with this but i assume that they have colors as well but i I don't even think I need to have the collection in order to be able to use this in terms of the papers and stuff because I can pretty much match anything to this, right? Just happy colors and so on. But, yep. And then I also never heard of a Doodle Pop. And so when I saw it on Joanne that they have a Doodle Pop grab bag, mystery bag, I said, okay, we'll, we'll try it. Um, normally, I guess these are $2 each. So it's a $40 value. And because you get 20 of them and it was on sale for, it was list price for 20. It was on sale for, let me see, was on sale for $13.99 and I got it for $9, $10. So basically they're $50, uh, 50 cents each, which make a lot more sense than $2 each. That. That doesn't make sense to me. So um, anyway, I thought they were really cute. Now, I didn't take these. There were so many. So I didn't take these out of the plastic bag, um, the wrapping. So I'm sorry if it's a little bit um, reflective for you. But they have some cute vegetables and fruits and margaritas and iced teas, popcorn and so on. Even a beer. Look at that cute dog and look at those cats. Oh my God, so cute. Some sports thing, even mustache and Vikings and so on. And then a few more in the back here. I thought these were so cute with the cute little house. Very Maggie Homish. That typewriter is my favorite. The globe and some flowers. So I thought that was a, a good deal for that. And then the paper I picked up, the, the only paper they had available wasn't too, wasn't too many things, but they had this special effects paper called chenille that have uh, 12, 12 different sheets and with all these colors. And I thought it was really, really pretty. Normally it's list price for $20 on Joanne and it was on sale uh, by the time I get the 30% coupon, it was on, I got it for $10, which basically mean it's about a little bit less than, what was it, about less than a dollar per page, which I think is worth it. And these are flocking, like almost velvet flocking, very pretty, gorgeous paper. They come in all these beautiful colors. Let me flip it for you so you can see this beautiful um, uh, fuchsia. Then we have red some coral. The design is exactly the same, but it's very usable. I mean, you could even cut them out and lay in them in different ways, maybe at, you know, mix the colors. I think that would be really fun. A green, a blue, 
a turquoise, a purple, a white, a brown, and then I don't know why they didn't do the black with like that. They gave you a black with just velvet, straight through, no design, nothing. Okay, so that's the set for the chenille, and I love it. Um, the one for the next, the, the only paper set that um, I saw at Joanne at least was the new Love Note collection that was introduced in February. Now, I've heard a lot of people talk about this set. They love it. Um, but I saw the one I heard first was from Christiane Adventure um, in one of her live stream um, sesh crafting sessions I, I watch I did not watch it live but in any case so this is super cute it's um came out in for Valentine this year in February it's called love notes and it has 12 double-sided paper with um, a sticker sheet similar to simple stories or you know some of the larger Echo Park um, pack so this is I think is so cute these tag cut apart is to die for it's um it's a uh, very pretty colors look at that um little cupcake on a stand there you know and so on the typewriter you're just my type you see them all these cute little love notes here and i like that they do the tag very clean on the back side so if you you do it and you want to pull it out of a a, a little tag flip or something it's nice and clean in the back instead of having some other weird design in the back so that me makes it very intentional um then they have some cute journaling um what do you call this um box <laughs> journaling stuff and it's um have lines and everything i think it's perfect i love that little postcard and then in the back it's the these uh cute multicolor hearts got some floral and this is just clouds tone on tone in light green but it's a uh, it's neat to see clouds in a different color than blue it's cute little floral page and this page say love you in uh, in a typewriter font everywhere okay then these stripes very bright color stripes and this page is just some flowers tone on tone pink this page have all the icon of Valentine's and spring. Very, very cute. And then some singing hearts. Some tickets, ticket stubs in all different color. Perfect to cut apart to use as an embellishment. Um, and then a plaid in multicolors. These hearts are also good to cut apart to use as part of an ephemera cluster or something and this is a tone on tone wood green in a light gray some polka dots and some flowers these are cute little love notes right little love envelopes and then some stripes in the back and this is a uh, strip border cut apart look how cute these little tweety birds are and then the cupcakes and the typewriter again and again the the bicycle and then the back is both co color polka dots this one is a floral tone on tone heart and the sticker sheet is this super pretty i love that one just a cute little tag some bubbles look like almost like a stamp some sentiment that you can cut apart and use separately love this little house and then some more border strips okay so that's love note i love it i think i got a good price for it and that's the end of the um my uh doodle bug haul from my joanne.com haul the next segment is going to be the 10 paper pads that i got at uh, joanne.com they were these are the park lane one with 24 sheets to design each i got five of i mean i got 10 of them 
and they were on sale for five dollars from twelve ninety nine nine ninety nine to twelve ninety nine normally. But because I had the thirty percent off coupon, I paid three dollars and fifty cents for each of these paper packs. Can you believe it? I know, right? So please join me in part three of this by Joanne com hall i look forward to seeing you soon and if you like this um, kind of content please consider subscribing or click on the like button um, i plan to make more um, product crafty hauls because my channel is new those are the easiest to make but i also i posted a scrapbooking process i'm getting ready to post a craft room organization type um, uh, video as well as card making and um uh, planning, you know, like using the happy planner uh, process as well. So I hope you join me later and until next time. Bye for now.